Hello everyone, it's Neil here from 3D Tudor, and I'm not back today with another tutorial. And I know it's been a while since I last uploaded a video, but it's finally here, as I promised, my latest online course. And it's a monster of a course, over 20 hours long, and it took a fair bit of effort to put this together. And as I promised, I said I would be making it free to all my subscribers, unless of course you would like to support me. At the moment, it's uploaded part one to Skillshare, and because it is so big, I've had to upload it into two parts, so the next part should be going on Skillshare in the next couple of days. It will also be going on Udemy in the next three or four days, as Udemy have to revise all their courses. So I'm going to put three links down below. One will be there now, and the other two links will be appearing in the next few days. The first link will be for the Skillshare, so if you've got Skillshare, you can go there and watch it for free. If you haven't got it, you might want to think about signing up for Skillshare. The second link, I'll put a coupon for Udemy for $9.99, so if you want to support my work, you're free to click on that one there. And finally, if you want the free link to Udemy, I will also post that down, it'll be the third link and it'll be totally free. And to everyone out there that supports me, or downloads it for free, I thank you all. So with that said, here's the intro to the course. Thanks a lot everyone. Hello and welcome to this fantastic course by 3D Tutor. My name is Neil and I'm a 3D modelling artist and online tutor. I have six years of modelling experience including assets, characters and environments. I have spent four years animating everything from simple wheels to multiple character rigs. I specialise in Blender, ZBrush, Topo Gun, Substance Painter and Unreal Engine 4. And of course you may have come across me on YouTube. So I welcome you to my latest guide. Blender 2.8, a beginner's complete 3D modeling guide of creating a medieval building scene. I will be using the brand new Blender 2.8 and the scale of this project will allow you to practice this new version as well. You'll only need a copy of Blender 2.8 for this course, which is completely free to download from the Blender website. And don't worry if you have a version below Blender 2.8, as everything in this course will also apply to earlier versions. If you haven't already checked out our other courses, then please take a look. The predecessor to this course was Blender for Beginners, creating a low poly 3D model complete introduction. Do you want to learn the full process of making a game ready medieval building scene? This will be one of the first extended length courses on Blender 2.8 since its release. I will introduce you to all the shortcuts and everything will be explained so complete beginners to Blender 2.8 will quickly find their feet and before you know it, you'll be creating scenes that look like you have spent years in Blender. It's the second course in the collection, and boy oh boy is this one jam packed to the rafters with knowledge. All the materials used in this course are available for free to download along with this course. The course comes with a massive library of 115 texture maps and 3 reference images, all created by 3D Tudor and unique to this course. Most of the textures are also seamless and they can be easily used in any assets you create in the future. When you download the textures, you can choose between 2 or 4K textures depending on your scene and the level your machine is capable of running. The course will teach you how to create module assets like walls in a way so you can use them to quickly create whole towns from a few meshes and make every building look unique. This saves you a great amount of time and will let you mix and mash different building parts into something unique and new. This course focuses on creating realistic and game ready buildings all within Blender 2.8. I have years of experience working with assets and environments set in the medieval era, so I thought I would put together a course to show you everything I've learned in those years. I wish I had a thorough tutorial to hand when I first learned how to use all the different elements of Blender, and I hope this lets you quickly grasp all the basic concepts of modelling, UV mapping, texturing, lighting and rendering. This course is aimed at complete beginners to Blender. We have integrated a sophisticated learning curve, so even if you're at a mid-level ability within Blender, you're still going to find plenty to learn here. The lessons will start off slow, explaining everything along the way, down to the very last bone press. We'll also be using screencast keys, so even if you don't understand something, you'll be able to see exactly what's being pressed. As the course progresses, we will quickly raise the speed and difficulty to accommodate your newfound skills and let you spread your wings. I will be showing you how to render out in both Cycles and EV. And through most of the course, we will be using EV to check our lighting and scene out. 
Finally, the medieval tavern will be rendered out using blender cycles. But you will still have the knowledge to use EV just in case you want to try it out. In this course, we'll go through everything and create everything together down to the smallest piece of wood, hence leaving no room for error or guesswork. You'll never be lost. And if you want to skip ahead, it is very easy to do as every course is distinctly named and an image will show you exactly what lesson you're heading into. Once you have finished the course, you have created a structure like the one you see in the main course image. The image you see will be exactly what you will produce and you will come away with not just the knowledge of how to build a tavern, but how to build an entire town. I will show you how to quickly make an asset library and how to put all the created assets into it so that you can quickly bring them into a build to build scenes very quickly. No items apart from the blender download are used, everything is right here within the course. The lessons for the most part start off short, but I've kept most lessons between 10 and 30 minutes so that they're easily accessible to pick up and take breaks. Start, stop and pause to your liking. You could even choose something you would like to create or something you did not know how to create rather than complete all the lessons. You will learn how to quickly and easily create assets using Blender's vast array of functions. You will also learn how to UV unwrap and mark seams out to create realistic materials. And finally you will learn how to quickly edit materials to make them suit the particular look you're going for. This course has a total runtime of 20 hours and 33 minutes and is made up of 57 classes so you can see that is truly an all-in-one course. And the lessons you learn here will take your modeling to the next level. Because the course is so huge we cannot possibly go through every lesson but you'll find a detailed explanation of the lessons in each lesson description. To give you an idea of the lesson content here is lesson 1 and next to it is lesson 55 just to show you how far you are coming in such a short space of time. I will be producing many other courses in the future, so please follow me as I take you on a journey from being a complete beginner to modeling like a pro that's been doing it for years.